Too often in sports we hear tales of teams or athletes heroically snatching victory from the jaw of defeat. On Sunday, New Orleans Pelicans managed to snatch defeat from the jaws of certain victory against the Phoenix Suns. With just 7.7 .7 seconds left on the clock, the Pelicans had a three-point lead at 136-133 after the game had been sent into overtime with both teams were locked on 122. That's when Pelicans coach Alvin Gentry took his remaining timeout. What happened after this point was so far from the realm of believable that you may have to see the video to be able to swallow it. Here's a summary of what happened, as Josh Jackson nailed a game-tying three-pointer with the clock ticking away in overtime, Gentry rushed to call a timeout his team didn't have. However, since the team did not have a timeout left, the officials slapped the team with a technical foul which culminated in Suns' Devin Booker on the free-throw line with 1.1 seconds left. Booker, who ended the night with 40 points and 13 assists, nailed his free throw to hand the Suns a 138-136 victory. That's the beauty of the sport, you never know what can happen. We came into the locker room, we were looking around and we still don't know what happened, but we'll take the win for sure, Booker said after the game. Milwaukee Cool Miami's heat the Milwaukee Bucks know a thing or two about snatching victory from the jaws of defeat. On Saturday, they showed just why they're deserving Eastern Conference leaders with a come-from-behind victory that seems like it was ripped out of the pages of a Hollywood flick. The Miami Heat had a 20-point lead going into halftime. Yet, somehow, 24 minutes later when the game ended, it was the Bucks who had emerged 113-98, creating history along with ways no other team in the history of NBA has ever trailed by 20 points at halftime and still gone on to win by a margin of 15 or more points. How not to defend? One of the defensive highlights of this week comes from Kyle O'Quinn. The Indiana Pacers star gave a demonstration on how not to defend at the NBA level. A look Kyle O'Quinn with the worst defense of all time loudly crying face via at Shackton pick.twitter.com slash e2asba complex sports at complex sports March 10th 2019 first post is now on whatsapp for the latest analysis commentary and news updates sign up for our whatsapp services just go to firstpost.com slash whatsapp and hit the subscribe button Updated date, March 18, 2019, 0 hours 5 minutes and 14 seconds IST.